What's up people, welcome back, welcome back. Well, in the previous video, uh, some of you guys had made some comments about the way that I was doing some things and I actually kept an ear out or an eye out for you guys' comments and I'm gonna make some changes to what, uh, to what I was doing to the tablet the way, or the way that I was connecting the audio via Bluetooth. Instead, I'm gonna connect it via aux cord so hardwire the the, uh, uh, the audio from the tablet to the single din and uh but i didn't want to do that because i had a problem and let me show you guys So uh, the power outlet was fine for the tablet, but the audio, which is right here, I had no way of freaking connecting any aux cord through here because obviously the temperature and volume control uh, little uh, unit right here is right here. So I can't, I couldn't do nothing about it. So I actually checked in the middle of this and this part right here is actually hollow so there's nothing in the bottom of this i took this whole pc uh this little uh pcb board out and i checked under here and there's nothing that runs through here this is a little support tab for this uh but it's still going to be connected through uh, some screws rip uh down at the bottom and uh down at the top so i'm not really too worried about uh this uh moving it or anything like that um yeah, so I'm gonna make a hole through here and here and then connect the aux cord via there via this hole right here. Now I just wanna say something. Some of you guys some of you guys might have been concerned of like, hey man, why are you spending so much effort on installing a tablet when they actually sell decks that are uh, Android already so you don't have to you don't have to do all these difficult fittings and stuff like that well the thing is that I had the tablet at home it was sitting so it was basically free I don't have to buy anything the single din the stereo was already in my car it came with the car I don't have to buy an extra unit so basically it's a free mod why not and you know who cares eh, if you want to go ahead and spend the extra $180 $280 to buy a Android or a double din unit by all means, go for it, man. But I just want to try it out. All right. All right. All right, folks. And this is like the finished product. Right there, the aux cord connects all the way in. And then um, on this side, the aux cord goes all the way through. And then the wire is going to run along all through the side of this, through the side of the panel. And it's not gonna bug anything the structure uh, is actually still pretty firm I don't know if you guys could see but I'm actually moving it along and or trying to move it along without the screws in it and it does not move so alright guys so you guys might actually get mad at me for this one because it's probably like the cheapest way uh, to mount this to the back but um for now, I honestly can't think of anything else, but uh, this plate is going to go right here. And the side lips right here are actually going to be taped around this and taped around this. And when the cords are put in from each side, it's actually going to prevent it from going up and down. And this plate right here is going to prevent it from going uh, in when I'm pushing from the outside. All right, fellas, so basically all I'm doing now is removing uh, this bezel right here because I am not going to need this anymore as this is where the double din is going to sit. And uh, the stereo is actually still going to be mounted to the Metro kit. And it's just going to, I'm just going to slightly move it more towards the back so the tablet has enough room to sit there and the stereo is not shaking up and down everywhere in the back. Um, the only thing that's going to be removed is obviously going to be this which is this single din uh, bezel right here. All right. All right guys, so here you have it. See, I actually just moved uh, the bolts 
uh, the screws a little bit back or they were mounted right here they were mounted right here and I moved them to the uh, hole in the back so now the stereo is not all the way to the front it sits back more so when the tablet goes to get mounted it's gonna sit right there boy Whew. that looks good well people as you guys can see the deck is actually I had them mounted at an angle because uh, the wires in the back were actually preventing it from uh, going all the way in. But uh, as you guys can see right here, I got it connected and uh, the volume is all the way up on this. And all I have to do is control it, either up or down. And yeah, man. Now this is where, uh, with the ex with the little tray in the bottom, actually put on. I mean, guys, honestly, this couldn't have been any more perfect. Uh, it just sits super flush, and I couldn't ask for a better fit, to be honest with you. But um, yeah, man. And uh, there you have it, folks. The mod is actually all done. Uh. I think it looks pretty sweet if you ask me. Um, I ended up adding another uh, 15 amp fuse to the wires that were charging the uh, tablet uh, just for precaution. And I had the tablet set up so the, the app set up so when the AC, watch, let me show you guys. Bam! Bam, bam, bam! It comes on and the tablet's automatically running and then uh, the music will start playing pretty much whenever you have it going on and uh, yeah yeah buddy I think it looks pretty sweet if you ask me I could control the volume Control the volume like that. I want it up. And yeah. So when I actually take it off, the tablet automatically shuts off and it stops playing the music and the tablet shuts off completely. Everything works. I could go on to maps. And uh, use the voice to actually navigate. Arizona Cardinal Stadium. Bam, pops up. Give me directions. Good start. Bam. And navigation will take me there. So everything works. I could use that. Uh, if I still want to go on YouTube, um, go on YouTube, whatever I want to do, let's bump some. Let's bump some, some Gucci. You know, everything works. Everything works. So, uh, I'm sorry for the delay. I actually had to go somewhere yesterday, so I didn't get to finish this. Uh, but, all in all, man, this, this is, uh, this was a pretty quick mod, man. It took anything within the two days that I worked in it, it probably took about three to four hours trying to figure out how I was gonna mount it and then uh, figuring out all the wiring. But other than that, I think it looks pretty sweet, man. All right, now you can say you have a tablet in your car. So I hope you guys enjoyed this. I hope you guys liked it. And this week I'm gonna start installing parts on the car. So like the control arms, the bushings, coilovers, uh, I'm gonna go, um, I, need, I need to figure out what size tires I'm gonna run on the rear wheels. So I'm actually gonna go to the tire shop and buy some new tires for the rears. Um, I'm thinking about 245s, 4018s, something like that. I have 225 40s in the, uh, in the front. And yeah, man, go through alignment, go through all that stuff and see how it's gonna look, all right? So please stay posted, hit that subscribe button and thanks for coming along with me. Enjoy, have a rest of the best of your day.
the rest the best of your day. What the heck? Have a great day. Peace.